Hey, so hello and welcome. This video is all about how we make a PR for the October first event. So, I'm not going to waste any time. Just uh, some steps are there. Okay. So, so again, so you can select any repository from the pin repository. I have uh, around six pin repository. You can select any. Suppose I'm going with this one. Okay. So, magazine price calculator. Okay. So first you have to click on any repository. After that you have to click on the fork. So yeah, click on this fork and. Uh, and this will take like this one and just click on the create fork okay so as you can see you can uh, fork the repository or you can see like a uh, your username and uh, get a repository name okay so what is the next step you have to uh, uh, go to for the https clone and just uh, copy this uh, link and you have to run the command get clone okay okay so you can see like a repository has been cloned you can see it's successfully done okay so now what you have to do you have to basically go into that into this project you can use any command from like this i'm using terminal for on ubuntu system okay so i am inside this project and now you have to open this uh, folder using vs code you can also go to the file manager and open like that okay so you can see like i have opened this uh, uh, folder in vs code okay what you have to do you can edit any file that you want you can when you can like add a new component anything so okay oh okay so for the testing purpose i am just adding one comment in the app.view file okay so here okay so this is the test comment okay save it and you can once you click on this icon basically you refresh it you will can see the change file over there okay you can see app is showing here just click on this plus icon and this is has this has been added into the state changes okay next step you have to check get status and you can see like uh, app dot view has been modified okay and next step you have to commit and you have to push the code so come for committing thing get commit and uh, message like uh, okay that comment message can be anything related to your work at that uh, comment inside app dot view okay cool okay so next step will be like a uh, save it yeah you can see like uh, one comment has been added next step will be yeah you have to push the okay so when you click on a get push so it will ask for the username and the password so username will be uh, your github username so for i'm just putting it here if you want to okay and the password pa uh, make sure that the password that you use is not the actual password you have to generate a token so how we can do that so okay just click on your profile thing and uh, just click on the settings and go to the bottom left corner click on the developer setting and uh, yeah so personal access token that is called pat and uh, so if you have any just remove revoke call or you can also generate a new token so i'm just generating a new token for this video purpose i will delete after this okay so just like uh, not either for that okay so like a test to okay and uh, expiration 30 okay no, not the 30 days 67 days okay so just saving these things okay uh, provide all the access that is needed because in future maybe you want to add or delete something so it's possible provide all give all the access just, just checking these boxes and uh, you know uh, so many check boxes are okay okay so okay so click on the generate token and uh, and uh, you can see like a token is here okay so i'm just copying it and make sure you have to save somewhere because if you if uh, this is a one time you will see okay so i'm just copy this clone and just click on this uh, password for this and you can see like uh, okay so you can see like uh, uh, code has been posted successfully so what we have to do so basically i just go to the back and do profile section and the uh, repositories uh, I'm working on this okay so once you push the code you can see your uh, latest commit commit over there and after that you have to click on a contribute so open you have to open up pull request on that okay so yeah create pull request click on this is the create pull request that you want to basically that will count towards your completion okay so everything is okay so you uh, so like uh, we have successfully made the pull request and uh, 
at the moment you do it after 30 minutes or 40 minutes uh, you can see your count on uh, October 1st uh, page has been increased so you have to make any four changes make any four, P four PRs and you will uh, complete the whole program I hope you enjoy this video if you have any doubt just post in comment section I will try to answer this okay so thank you